Okay, this is an old, uh, clearly decades old Singer sewing machine. I'm gonna just quickly walk through how it's uh, uh, set up. Um, so here you see there's a two uh, threads kind of hold them to the side. Uh, it's going through the needle here and then it's going through this little uh, thing here and it's wrapped around this piece of metal here and then it goes to this thing that goes up and down here there's a little hole at the end uh, and then here this one's a little tricky this one is uh it's sort of wrapped around the back here it's wrapped well it's it's going through this little this little metal loop but it's it's and it's going underneath here and then it's let me see it's it's wrapped once around this so it's it's going down on the back and then it's wrapped around here one time and that's it and you can see it's 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 out in front here and then it's uh one time it's going through this little metal loop and then it's going around here now here it had to make a modification uh, because it was a spring inside here a metal spring but it was uh it was a little old and rusty so so that spring was was removed or at least most of the spring was removed and a different spring was put in there so it's it's not there's not as much tension so this is wrapped around here one time so and this this one here is on is on bottom and this one here is is on top so you can see it's just it's wrapped around one time and then on top before it goes through this metal loop and then it's connected through this little hole that goes straight to the thread in the back here so that's how this is set up and it's pretty finicky so I had to try a bunch of different settings these are the settings uh, kind of the mostly in the middle ones uh, to get this thing to work and that's that and uh, the more complicated thing is I think uh, is setting up this thing in the bottom here, winding some uh, some more thread for the bottom, this part here. That's it.